Hey everybody, it's Gamer Number 98 here, and welcome back to Let's Play Banjo 2E. Last time we did stuff. That's all I have to say. I wait, no, I don't want to warp. I said we were gonna see Mumbo in this part, so how's about I keep that promise? Uh, take that. Take them. Oh well. Let's just avoid them then. Damn, 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 damn. Jeez. Uh, Is there really going to be more fail this time? Oh hey, can someone get the phone? I can hear it ringing. Uh, where's the globo? Oh dear. There's no globo. <laughs> um. No globo. Wait, did I? Wait. Oh, I did miss one. Ah, yes, the, the one near, the one near Humba Wumba. And where was that? <sighs> Looks like we're gonna fail today again. Ugh. Blow that up. Jeez. Oh. I'm, I'm. You know what? It seems clear to me that I'm just not. I'm just not right for recording today. No, oh, I don't know, guys. I haven't been in the best mood lately. It's one of those. I think life sucks kind of deals. Come on, let's just... Come on, chin up. Turn the frown upside down. Just play the game. Have some fun. I'm not having fun failing. I believe the globe bow was over here. Yeah. Oh yeah, you can't actually do anything about that yet. They actually make you wait. Come on, come at me. Oh no, I still got hit from that. Ugh. Gonna hold yourself. Anyway, we're gonna go get to Mumbo now. And we're gonna bring him to the ice side. Okay, we're out now. So, remember the alien who crashed down here? Well, Mumbo can basically bring him back to life, if you will. Just carefully walk across this. That's not carefully. Carefully is not fall. Not carefully is falling off. Fantasy and reality are different. Fantasy is good. Reality is bad. True fact. Okay, careful, because it is slippery. Here we go. No stand. Okay, there we go. Hope this works. Life Force. Alien Dad. Big drop hurts slots. Where am I? You dead. Mumbo used powerful shaman magic. You alive. Did it need puny earthling magic? Could have used special powers instead. Spaceman ungrateful. Waste Mumbo's time. Me should teach lesson. 
Sorry, strange friend. My special powers are low and we need your help. Our three children have escaped the ship before we crashed into the lagoon. If you can find and return them to me safely, I'll bestow the earth with wondrous gifts. Mobile-like gifts, not tacky alien merchandise though. <laughs> Kids will be hiding from danger until they detect alien signal. Mumbo impressed, but Mumbo much better. So all we have to do now is go find the three kids. This is... Now get this. Mumbo's needed for one of them, but we can't get to that one. One has Mumbo, so we have to switch back and forth between Banjo Kazooie and Mumbo. <laughs> so then, let's start saving the kids for the children. <laughs> no, don't tank through the water, it's too dangerous. Look how little life you got left. This first one's pretty simple. Just break the ice. Thanks, Eflin. Um, he's going for the icy water. That bad. Okay, I better take care of this one. What's wrong with it? It's me. You could try beak to mouth resuscitation. Ugh, no chance! Then this is a job for a professionally qualified doctor. <laughs> oh, that, that was a good line. Beak to mouth resuscitation. Right, so being Mumbo again, it's pretty obvious what to do now. Just go back to that same Mumbo pad and use Life Force on the kid. Don't fall. Okay, that's good. So, more Life Force. Now there's a reason I'm taking care of this one before the final one, because because this alien kid has a pretty funny line. Not now, though. Thank you! Earthlings not all brain dead! Ugh. Here we go. The, pink, the one in pink. Just, 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 just check this out. Wow! I was dead and you used magic? Let's do it again! <laughs> well, time to be the bear and the bird once again. No, that's not the end of it. No, we're gonna have to be Mumbo a third time, you know. Bear and bird once again. Now, the third and final child is quite high up. It's a good thing we wait for the icicle girl so we can get back in there quickly. We're gonna need Kazooie by herself for the final one. Come on, game, cooperate with me. No more slow down, alright? Oh, Banjo, jump. Come on, let's just go. We already came this way before, but we're gonna have to go there again. Where Jam Jaws taught us how to glide, we're gonna have to go up there again. With Kazooie alone, again. Okay, come on now, let's split up. Yeah, sure, why not? Okay, Kazooie, let's go. Oh, really? Only two? There we go, glide, glide, glide. 
That's right, just take it easy. I could talk to Jam Charles again and he'll fully restore me. You know what? I will do that. Oh damn it, I wanted to skid out of here on Kazooie's bum. Well, I guess I can't do that. There's something else to pick up actually while we're up here that I didn't get first time. Right, so over there is the alien child. But over here is a Cheeto page. Um. Yeah, I should be able to get them both. Oh no! Oh no! Oh. oh. Okay, that's good. There's only four more Cheeto pages left in this whole game. Alright, here we go. I, I love this conversation here. Cool! A little alien baby! Mommy! Don't look at me, kid! So, so, so cold! Mommy! Daddy! Me not like cold airflame planet! For, for freezing warm baby, please! Ah, uh, uh, I mean, stop whining, kid! <laughs> oh, Kazooie! Yeah, I'm not kidding. You have to hatch it. L kind of. Great. Me nice and toasty now. Time to go home. That's that. You have done well, Earthling, but I shall now have to exterminate you for taking so long. Uh, have you kids seen my laser anywhere? Ah, uh, it must be on the ship. Your race is spared for now, Earthling. Stand clear, beaming up, sequence initiating. Beam us up, Scotty. All your best are belong to us. Exterminate and other cliched alien quotes. Remember, I'll be right here. I like Kazooie get the cheeky brown set. Whoa, you shouldn't be there, Kazooie. I'm somewhere where you shouldn't be. Oh, ow. Can you imagine that hurt? 68! These are coming along nicely now. Alright, guess what? We're gonna get Mumbo's help again, but... Okay. Let's get Banjo back. Okay, good. Don't let him knock you into the pit because it's possible. So, time to get to Mumbo. <laughs> Again! And yeah, new Super Mario Bros. 2 comes out tomorrow. I'm going to pick it up even though I still have my doubts about it, but I'll save my fun of it to have actually played it. So, after controlling Mumbo for the third time, which thankfully should be the last in this world, actually it will be the last time in this world, we're gonna go over this way. Game, your frame rate is atrocious. This way. Well, no, not actually that way. But it's pretty close. Here we go. Past Boggy's new egg glue. And you notice another mumble pad. Now in here is an in now this um jiggy quest is actually a bit of interesting rare history. Life Force Saberman. Yep, we're reviving Saberman. 
For those of you who don't know, well, I, I'll be explaining it in a minute after this. Many thanks, young sir. Why, I've been frozen in there since 1984. Mumbo thinks he's crazy old man before, perhaps. It's quite possible. I came from a golden age where wolves were kings. The name's Saberman. Adventuring is my game. Or at least was my game. What Gable Man doing in Ice Block? That cursed Saber Wolf chased me all the way here where I was frozen in my tracks by the ice dragon. I'm rather cold, could you see your way to warming me up? Mumbo not do that, but no bear that might... So yeah, Saberman. He is actually a, a rare character from the 80s. He starred in Saberwolf. You see, a bit of um interesting history is that when Rare was first founded by the Stamper Brothers, they formed Ultimate Play of the Game. And they first off started making games for the um, very popular British computer called the ZX Spectrum. And one of their games was Saberwolf, and it starred Saberman as the main protagonist. Now, this is basically more or less just a cameo of Saberman. He did get, ret get returned, if you will in a GBA game called Saber Wolf, which was basically just like a remake of the original or something like that. There's also apparently got there were also apparently plans to make a Saber a Saber Wolf game for the Xbox, I think it was, but that was scrapped. So a bit of interesting rare trivia for you guys. All started out with rare making games on the ZX Spectrum, then they moved to the NES and other systems at the time. Then they brought silicon graphics, and then basically with their new expensive technology they showed it to Nintendo and they were impressed, and for us, Rare made Donkey Kong Country. And that's pretty much it. Right, this, this should be pretty obvious what you have to do, you have to heat him up. And if you look behind him, that's actually the ice safe where we got the Mega Globo. I say, any chance of a little heat? Yes. Hit him with a bunch of I fire eggs to warm him up. And he's nice and toasty. That's so much better. Glad to help an old hero. Been frozen for so long has tired me. I need a cup of tea and 40 wings. Could you possibly help me just one more time? Of course! This sounds like a job for you, Banjo! Can you carry me back to my tent? It's over on the fiery side of the mountain, if it hasn't burned down by now. Yep, that's his tent. So, pretty obvious what you have to do here. You just need to pick him up with Banjo and carry him there. The trip's pretty short, as long as you take the warp pad up here. Um, I glitched it. Rest up, Banjo. I'm not taking any risks. Alright, here we go. Come here, Saber Man. You're going in the bag! No, let's see. If we try to... If we try to release him when we're not there... No, no, this isn't right. I don't remember pitching my tent here. Oh, takes more than one hit, that guy. Let's just, let's just go, hurry. Pretty simple. Just, just take him to his tent. This is it. My tent, my equipment, it's just as I left it all those years ago. It's probably worthless anyway. 
My treasure is still here too. You may have it, kind sir. It's a fine golden jigsaw piece. No use to me. I'm hanging up my boots. So he's gonna go off to sleep now. Or is he? Hey, guess what? 69, dudes! He actually mows a few lines, but only at this one time. Perhaps I'll ride on a dolphin. I mean, if you look carefully, his eyes are clearly open. Come on, what else has he got to say for us? I wonder what adventures may await me. Another line is, is where he says, Bears in their own games. Bah! But after that, it doesn't really say anything else once you leave. Okay, that's, that's gonna do it for now, I think. We did a lot of revitalization today, didn't we? So, let's end things off. So next time on Banjo do we? Um, we're gonna do some more stuff in Hellfire Peaks, and that's pretty much it, really. So until next time, see you later. Mm-hmm.